name is Jan Eliasberg, and I am a film and television writer and director. I've also been a producer of my own work. I was actually the second class of women at Wesleyan. Going into the theater department and experiencing the classes there, I came to realize that I really wanted to direct. There was this wonderful space, the 92 Theater, that was being evacuated, and I petitioned the student government to give me some money and asked the administration to give me the space for a year to make the 92 Theater into a student-run theater. In my sophomore year, I found myself directing plays, enticing people to come and do their work, and I found myself in the middle of an extraordinary theater department where two years before there really hadn't been one. The experience of founding Second Stage certainly gave me a sense that I could be proactive and I could be an agent in creating my own creative life. And that has never left. I had taken Janine's Hawks Hitchcock class. It was one of the best classes I had ever taken, and I decided that I wanted to experiment and see what film directing was like. So I applied for a grant from the American Film Institute Directing Workshop for Women, and I made a short film, which got onto the festival circuit and promptly got me three jobs as a television director. Cagney and Lacey, LA Law, and Miami Vice. And I was the first woman to direct Miami Vice, and Michael Mann personally chose me to do it. Wesleyan gave me a level of confidence to go into a situation that was quite intimidating. It was a very male, driven action show. You know, I found myself doing chase sequences and action sequences and shooting and all of these things that I wasn't trained for, but I had the confidence that I could do it. And in fact, it turned out to be a creative match made in heaven because a lot of the stories on Miami Vice were in fact social and political in the ways that had drawn me to theater in the first place. I'm not one to sit around waiting for other people to present opportunities. If I want to do something, I generally take the leap and create it, whether that means making a short film, putting together financing to direct something, writing a project on spec, because I believe that if you build it, they will come. And it's been true with pretty much every everything else I've done in my career. It is such a tribute to Wesleyan that they allow that kind of individual responsibility and they encourage students to follow their passions. 